What's up, my people? Hope everybody's well. Hey, so listen, this week I had a whole plan figured out about a video I wanted to make, and unfortunately that couldn't happen because last Saturday I had some issues with my vehicle, and thank goodness it wasn't anything serious, but um, it did hinder my ability to be mobile for the weekend. And then also, I caught the flu. And I've been sick all week, so it's been a tough week, and I'm still trying to maintain that same rigorous schedule that I do um, despite the illness. So this week, I more or less wanted to focus on um, what it's been like to uh, focus on this project, this YouTube channel. It's been a bit of a challenge, and I kind of want to go over some of the things that I've been learning, the things I feel like I should learn, and I'd really like to hear some commentary from you, all right? So let's begin. Actually, it's fun. It's really fun. I'm surprised how much fun I'm having with this. Despite the fact that um, I have to be disciplined about it, um, I, I like the idea of putting something together and there being an end product. It, it actually excites me. It makes me ha kind of happy to see that um, some of my friends and some of my family members have responded so well to it. I don't know, I just like the idea of, of doing something and I think because I've been wanting to do this for such a long time and now the fact that I'm just putting this stuff out there, there's some sort of feeling of satisfaction that really, um, that really makes me feel fulfilled. So um, as much as I want to call this a project and a hobby, it is starting to become sort of a part of me to some degree. There's a, there's a learning curve to this. Yeah, but I'll tell you what, man, it's, it's for me personally, it's been really fun. It's been really fun and I like um, that I get messaged by people who I haven't heard of in, in years. And even if maybe they didn't subscribe, they're, they're still watching, which is pretty crazy. Um, I, I know, it, I don't have a lot of views. That's, that's fine, but that's not the point. I never even thought I was gonna have 10 subscribers. I never even thought I was gonna be able to do five videos for that matter okay like i said this is a work in progress for me but i can tell you this right now i really like it and um yeah I, I'm, I'm i'm learning a lot of stuff people's reaction um i've had a series of different reactions but for the most part um, i've received a lot of love i've received a lot of support uh people have also um been reappearing in my life people that I haven't spoken to in a long 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 period of time and uh, to some degree it's nice and to some degree it's a little bit strange um, but the fact that people are going out of their way to give me suggestions to even try to help me um, I I'm gonna take any feedback and try to turn that into something positive and try to hone this thing that I'm working on but for everybody out there that's been actually watching these things um, I I'm thank you really because I never even thought people were gonna be interested in this kind of thing I mean mostly I'm doing this for me um, but I'm starting to get a different sense out of it and I'm kind of starting to like it because uh, of the reaction. I, not to say that I'm immune to commentary and all that stuff, but to be honest, it's just, it, I, I like this interaction that, that I'm having with, with, uh, with the viewers. Uh, the most difficult thing I think was starting. Once you do that first, that second, that third video it just starts to become automatic um, the next thing that's difficult is keeping a schedule you have to understand that um, you need to take time to prepare what you're gonna say you need to take time to prepare how much time you're gonna film where you're gonna film what you're gonna film it's crazy I'm learning a lot of things regarding this because um, as you know or as I've mentioned before I have a very tight schedule and it can be quite rigorous so for me to even continue to produce this has been a little bit of a challenge but it's a challenge I'm willing to take because of the positive feedback I received and because of the things I felt like I've been learning. Another thing to keep in mind is just like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, life happens. Life happens and you gotta think quick on your feet and you gotta figure out ways of staying creative. For example, this whole thing with my car was completely unexpected. I got the flu, um, you know, you go through some personal things that can hinder you and can make you lose motivation to continue, but you have to remember that if this is something you like and something you wanna do, you can't stop. Right now, personally, I, I didn't even know if I was gonna record this thing and then continue, but um, at this point, I feel like I'm on a roll because I've done those, those little measly five videos, but for me, um, they have been meaningful and, and that's what's making things um, roll for me, but it, it is it is a challenge It's not an easy thing to balance because it's very easy to lose motivation 
Um, the other thing that's been difficult for me is that um, I've kind of re-emerged out of the depths of being away from social media. Um, as some of the people that are very close to me know, I kind of stayed away from social media for almost maybe two years, maybe three. I don't know. It's been a while. That's how long I've been off social media. So re-exposing myself and um, putting myself out there is a little bit unsettling. Um, because as much as some people want to say I am an extrovert, I think I've learned to be an extrovert, but I am a bit of an introvert and this is a kind of a difficult thing for me to do. This channel is, is, is important to me. I'm telling you right now, it, it's, it's, it's not an easy thing to do. So I have a lot of respect for those people that are doing this consistently more than once a week, because even for me, just one week is really challenging. Hopefully um, I, can keep my, I can keep my momentum going and, and continue with this channel. So there's always gonna be difficulties no matter what, and that goes for anything in life. So I'm either gonna make the excuses or I'm just gonna pull through, you know, and sometimes the content's gonna be great and sometimes the content is gonna suck and that's what it is and I don't mind because the important thing for me is to keep this thing going the other thing that's also difficult about making these videos is filming in public it's a little bit awkward to be out there with a tripod and people are looking at you like what is this person doing <laughs> and you, you have this thing you're walking around with this camera on your face just talking to it um, people are constantly gonna look at you um, some people you might feel like oh I'm being judged it is awkward but it does get more comfortable. It does get to some degree comfortable, but then it doesn't get comfortable. Um, the camera is not the issue. I think it's the perception you have about your surroundings and the people around you. And the thing is, if, if you let that bother you, it can influence the way that you, that you talk and the way that you express yourself. And that in itself can affect the way that people perceive you when they're watching your videos. So I think that's the other difficult thing, the, the aspect of speaking outside to a camera in front of people and strangers when you're in random places, for sure. The quality of my shots will improve if I just focus on, you know, uh, you know making sure that I have the right light, lighting, uh, making sure that, that, that I have a good composition, you know, it's, it's, it, camera work is a little bit tricky and sometimes it, it you know in, in your surge to try to get things done on time you're kind of moving around with your camera just shifting back and then when you come back to post and you want to edit man it's it's difficult to find footage I definitely would like to focus on better transitions at least learning a more creative way of utilizing them um, and I and I understand it varies it depends on the kind of videos that you make so it's a good thing to pick up and I think it's something that I should incorporate into my videos let me know what you think I think um, sound has been um, a thing I've been struggling and I know that sometimes the sound is way high or way low I'm still experimenting with those balances It's kind of nice to be able to know that people that want to, you know, look me up or see me or see how I'm doing um, can actually have access to me in maybe an indirect way, but at least for the people that I care about and the people that, that I feel are going to be as supportive um, as they can be, uh, it, it's nice to, to know that there's someone out there that's to some degree trying to keep up or maybe you're even influencing in a positive way to like, you know, do their own thing or maybe you're motivating them to try something that they've never tried before at least for me I hope that that's the the, the positivity um, that I'm throwing out there because like I said this is a thing I've been wanting to do for a long time and it, it's very meaningful for me to be able to even start this and have someone watch it and continue with it I, I really want to develop this thing because I think it's it's something that's helping me somehow I don't know how to explain it to you but I feel like it's helping me um, here and here for me it's something that's that's developing and in, into something I never thought it would it's it's influencing me to try more things it's influencing me to go out there and, and do other things that I really want to focus on and do and this is a big step for me and it's a very scary and it's a challenge it's very much a challenge because again I'm I'm people are gonna be at least open to a bigger window into my life that I than I ever had before so that aspect of it is scary but that aspect of it is also exciting to some degree it's something that's really fueling me to have an objective to have a goal to do 
things that I didn't even think about before. Um, I feel like I've been stagnant in a lot of ways and somehow this has helped me become more creative with my own ideas and what I want to develop myself into for the future. Um, if anything, this is the sort of way of keeping myself accountable. In a sense, I guess you can say that it's making me, it's making my confidence grow to some degree. So to all of you out there um, who want to do this, I commend you because it, it's not easy. It's not easy. And for anybody that knows me, they know I'm not like, uh, I, I like a challenge and I like things that are difficult and this is one of them. Um, so don't be afraid to do those things because even with my short time on this thing, I feel a sense of accomplishment, I feel, I feel a sense of motivation, a sense of pride, and, and, and I want others to feel this way. Enjoy what you're doing and don't worry what people think, alright?